Hi, I'm Dr. Dan Rubin from Naturopathic Specialists. I'm a board certified naturopathic oncologist and I'm here talking about how to use and set up a microcurrent device. Now, we very frequently use what's called a frequency specific microcurrent device and if you've purchased one, this is how to set it up. So generally what you'll find in terms of supplies is the actual device. This is the typical one that we use. This is called a custom care. This is how to turn it on. And it turns on. And what we do is we wait and then use this mode button to select the mode. And those different modes in here are the different programs that we may or would suggest for you. Now you can only scroll one way. So if you miss it, you have to go all the way through it. <clears throat> Once you select your program, you would then press this button right here called Run. And then it starts running. And this first number here says zero because we've had zero minutes of the 55 minutes in this particular program. These buttons turn up or down the amperage. And the amperage can be found right here. Right now this is at 100 milliamps. So we'll generally turn this up to about 150, sometimes higher, especially if we use the magnetic converter. So this is running, but this is not delivering a current anywhere because there's nothing hooked up to it. So I'm just going to pause it. And this is the, these are the electrodes. These come with the kit. And so when you connect it, you connect it to these ports and you have to line them up specifically. So you first pull back on this collar and then you insert and then you let go of the collar so it's firm. And then I would either just put this in my pocket or I would put it back in here and I would carefully unravel it. And you can see that you have these four electrodes, different colors. And these connect up to alligator clips. And all you do is take the respective alligator clip color and you insert the electrode. That's an alligator clip. There's metal in there. That's because we need to conduct electricity using a liquid medium. We have four colors. Black and yellow are always paired together and red and green are always paired together. And I'm missing my black one. Here it is. So what would we do with this then? Well, oops. we would either take a wet towel, we would make this wet, and we would put it on the respective part of the body, wherever we were treating, and this is usually done in the clinic. For home use, what's going to happen is either you're going to have one of these resonance wraps, which is a towel. This is what they look like in the package. This is what they look like after you've used them quite a bit because these become wet. And you simply connect these electrodes up. It's as simple as that. So now we're going to talk about gel pads. Gel pads um, are simply that. They're sticky pads impregnated with gel, and they connect seamlessly and effortlessly to these electrodes. You could simply pull off the alligator clip and just put on the pad. It's a nice tight connection, and that pad would be applied to whatever area your prescription calls for. That's the gel pad. Also, and most commonly would be used would be this magnetic converter. This is the FSM magnetic converter and this is where you're going to connect up the electrodes. They're color coded. So what you would do is the black would go in the black, which looks a little blue on this, but it's the right color. The yellow 
goes in yellow. Red gets plugged into red. Green gets plugged into green. And it looks like that. Very clean connection. But you need something to deliver, something to plug in, because now our machine, which is delivering the microcurrent, is plugged into this magnetic converter. Why? Because this converter converts this frequency into a pulsed electromagnetic frequency, and you now have the most versatile pulsed electromagnetic frequency device that you can get. This becomes a PEMF. So what you would do is you would take these, the other part of the converter, and it just uses a standard connection, and you would plug it in, just like that. You take the other one, you plug it in, simply, and then you're ready to treat. Now, I would uncurl these, and now I have quite a bit of distance with which to treat. Now I want to show you this magnetic converter. These rubber sticky pads have some staying power, but a lot of people prefer to take these off. What we did is we cut ours so it was easy on, easy off. We cut ours right there. And now you could simply slip that in the pocket. Unwrap this one. Remove the rubber, put it in my back pocket. Now I'm portable and I can walk around and I can do my activities of daily life as I'm getting a microcurrent treatment. I could be using this while I sleep. I could then get comfortable in my chair. These fit in these bags very nicely. So you could wind these cords up, you could carry it with you. That's how you set up your frequency-specific microcurrent device with FSM magnetic converter.